Hello, my name is Rich Gummersall. I'm the Off-Highway Vehicle Education Coordinator for the Idaho Department of Parks and Recreation. Today, we're going to talk about the principles of tread lightly. When we're out recreating and we're riding on our designated trail, we want to follow those principles to ensure that our opportunity remains open for years to come. The first is travel responsibly. When we travel responsibly, we're staying in the trail bed. Even though there may be hazards, we want to stay in the trail. We don't want to go around, thus increasing the size of the trail. We want to use our vehicle to go over those obstacles as they were designed. Then we want to respect the rights of others. When you think about that one, that, that's simply being a good steward, following ethics, doing the right thing, and communicating with the other user groups when we're out having a good time. Then we need to educate ourselves. That comes in many fashions. Education comes in ensuring that you're using a motor vehicle use map. Taking a safety course so you know the ins and outs of your vehicle. And then talking with your passengers if you're in a UTV so everybody understands any crash protocols or emergency actions that may need to be applied. Once we've got those three going, we need to avoid sensitive areas. Again, passing through water, coming up on marshes, in open meadows. We want to stay on the designated trail. If the trail crosses a stream, we want to enter the stream slowly, carry enough momentum to get us through, and exit the other side on the trail in that slow manner as well. And then we need to do our part. Doing our part is leaving it better than you found it. When you go out and you see somebody that has maybe left some trash, pack it out. Do your part to keep opportunity available for years and years to come. A sad message that we need to part is since 1978, Idaho has lost 40% of its OHV opportunity on our public lands. Terrible thought, but yeah, 40% we've lost in opportunity around the state.